Hi, Ellen. Welcome. It's been a while, hasn't it? Can you stay long today? It has been a while, but I didn't come here to pick up our old friendship. I just wanted to check out this Civilization Preservation Foundation. I wanted to know why you would leave home. Aren't you the Bullnose heiress? There's a couple reasons why I left home, but that's not why I came to Senjo. Is it because I'm here? There was something your dad, Mr. Sukioka, said. I wanted to check up on it. Your robots. Mr. Sukioka mentioned them once or twice. My dad did that? Ellen, why would he tell you about the Mega Knights? Even I didn't know about them till recently. Hey, how about showing me one of those robots? Okay. That's something spectacular. I didn't have a clue that Tsukioka was making robot weapons. It's not a robot weapon. It's a Mega Knight. Mega Knight? Well, isn't that just your robot weapon? A Mega Knight is a Mega Knight. It's neither a robot nor a weapon. The Mega Knights were not developed as weapons. Most definitely not. Mega Knights were developed as the successors to humankind. Mechanical humans. They are the Mega Knights. Mechanical humans? Are you serious? You know of Nectar Radiance, correct? The life-destroying rays that drift in space. No living thing can survive it. Nectar radiance prevents living organisms from exploring space. Indeed, it allayed humankind's hopes to advance to the stars. Yeah, I know about the deadly nectar radiance. I learned about it in school. Nectar Radiance represents a barrier to humankind's efforts to extend its boundaries. Since humankind cannot venture into space, it will eventually become extinct. However, mechanical humans can explore in our stead. The Mega Knights, their bodies unaffected by Nectar Radiance, will be our successors. Humankind's successor? I think partner would be more accurate. For humankind to survive to the year 3000, we need the help of the Mega Knights. We humans need friends who can withstand Nectar Radiance. And that's what this is? The research will take decades. We are nowhere near finished. I can't believe that's what you were making. No wonder Tsukioka went broke. A plan that huge? There's no way there's enough money. That's exactly it. Anyway, the weapons were added later. Mega Knights were never intended to be weapons. I get it. But it blows me away that someone would actually take that delusion seriously. The people shelling out the money, too. They'd have to be nuts. Tell me something I don't already know. We've heard plenty about it. But those invading robots, they are ample proof that we weren't delusional. What are you saying? Huh? You mean the Volgara?
What is that? Hmm. Long distance phantom teleportation right into town. The self defense forces defensive line is utterly meaningless. It's just like a ghost. Damn it. It's going to be a massacre if it's left unchecked. Hey, I've got to help with the evacuations. You take that mech out. We'll do that, Ellen. Be careful. Bet on it. I'm counting on you. Station. Keep the enemy away until evacuations are done. <coughs> Ellen here. I'm evacuating the supermarket. Try to keep the enemy away. are complete. No need to hold back now. Pound it!
Dylan, are you okay? Yeah. Evacuations went smoothly, thanks to our training. Losses should be minimal. I'm glad to hear it. I thought we'd get to show you the Mega Knight, but not like this. Yeah? Well, maybe you can give me a proper demonstration some other time. You know, I'm reminded of something from a long time ago. I recall having a conversation with your father, Mr. Sukioka. He said that he'd give me a Mega Knight when I got older. What? The name was... Baldor. Yeah, that's right. Baldor. Baldor? I've never heard about any Mega Knight named that. Was Daddy just being silly? We bring you a follow-up report on yesterday's Volgara incident. A night after the Volgara attack, the scope of destruction has become evident. Fortunately, the damage has been minimal. The damage was concentrated in downtown Senjo. Total damage is estimated to be below 1 billion yen. For this, Senjo plans to reward the Foundation with a special award. Good afternoon, we bring you breaking news. This is footage taken from a surveillance camera. Presently, a Volgara robot is approaching Senjo. Evacuations are underway. However, an armored evacuation bus has stalled. The immobile bus has been left behind in the city. Some 30 civilians are said to be trapped inside by an auto lock system malfunction.
30 civilians are trapped inside the stored armored bus. Its malfunctioned autolock system has turned it into an impregnable prison. Use the Mega Knight to rescue that bus. Press the R2 and L2 buttons at the same time to make it squat down. Then, tip the right analog stick up to make it hold what's in front of it. Make it hold the bus. You can grab with the left tool. Tip the left analog stick up while squatting. while you go fight the enemy. Yep, okay, we'll put the bus down. Tip the analog stick up while squatting to set down what's being held. The control is the same as how to grab things. If you punch while holding something, Mega Knight will throw what's in its hand. Don't throw the bus.
took years off my life. Hey, you! Huh. Way to go! You're some kind of driver. You're, uh, really something. You stayed calm and did exactly what you had to do. I, I could learn a thing or two off you. A night damage appears to be worse than originally estimated. Damage was Total damage is estimated to exceed 20 billion yen. Don't throw the bus! 